the thing about flying, if you ask most of the people on this field, describe aviation, grassroots aviation, in one word, the single most common answer you'll get is freedom. It gives you a freedom like nothing else. People talk about freedom on motorcycles, but imagine a motorcycle with wings. Aviation is three dimensions, you're above everything. And literally, when you leave the ground, you leave everything behind. The flying essentially goes from Friday to Sunday on one weekend in September. People show up on Friday night and camp. The big day is Saturday and Sunday's go home day. An aircraft flying like this is equivalent to your county car show. So where you and your friends will get together and go to a car show from the county, at a fly-in all your friends from around the nation show up. It's a very interesting thing. We have a lot of friends, we have very few that live near us. But people fly in, we see them twice a year, they'll come into an event and they're like some of our best friends and they may be from California, there's people here from Maine, um, people here from Texas, a couple of planes from Southern Florida, it's amazing. People come in from overseas for this event. Well, there is a lot that happens behind the scenes to make this kind of event happen. Uh, most people aren't really aware of all those things and um, from planning to ordering tents and being sure there's people here who can do the food and that it's food that everybody's going to like and easy to prepare and serve um, to pennant ropes to being sure the flow of things goes smoothly even beforehand making sure that the grounds are prepared one guy approached me and he said, you know how many smiles you put on people's faces by having this? And you know, it really is. There's a smile on every face. You don't see anybody here frowning. So everybody's having a good time and it does make you feel good that you can enable people to have a good time. The Lee Bottom Fly-In provides such a unique atmosphere. Uh, it really is just a, a fantastic gathering of, of unique, uh, historic airplanes and, and the people that, that uh, own them and fly them and love them. You know, I've been flying for, for 15 years and, and been to airports all over the country and this is unlike anything else I've, I've experienced. Lee Bottom is an old-fashioned flying field. They used to call airports flying fields because they literally were flying fields. The surfaces up through early 30s were mostly dirt, grass, gravel, but by far they were mostly grass. The airport here is actually public use. We certify it just like any county airport, any public airport you go to. This one's certified the same way. It's kind of unique. There, there are others, but not many, privately owned public use airports, which is what this is. <laughs> the camaraderie of the event, uh, one of the things after it started to grow and people were telling their friends to come, uh, we started getting people that we didn't even know that attended. So it became kind of extended family at that point and we actually every year have more and more people that have never been here as opposed to kind of a regular crowd that attends. It's like our regular crowd has become the volunteers to help put the event on and then we have new people that come. Pretty much you name it in terms of historic airplanes, uh, antique aircraft. Um, you know, everybody that's interested in aviation has their, their favorite type of aircraft and, and you're almost going to find just, you know, prime examples of all of those here. Contact on both.
Aviation is a sport of freedom. It was, it was born because of a passion for freedom. People wanted to be free. They wanted that extra dimension. Well, that's why aviation is a uniquely American sport. It's not a political thing. It's not a religious thing. It is just a pure feeling of freedom that you can't get any other way. Yeah.